President Obama announced this My RA account, my retirement account, I guess. It's, at the, it's called the Thrift Savings Plan Government Securities Investment Fund. From uh, this year, they had an, uh, an annual return of 1.47%. Basically, it's through your employee, you have your employer deduct from your paycheck an amount that you want to define. It can be $5 a paycheck, whatever you want, $50, $100. And it goes into this these federal bonds. So I'm looking at this thinking, oh, this is kind of cool because, you know, it's not, it's not, you know, the, the, my problem with 401ks and IRAs and things like that, and, and the reason why up until last year I never even had one. And last year it was just like, you know, my CPA was like, you've got to do this. Come on, don't be an idiot. I'm like, oh, you know, okay. But, and, and gee whiz, you know, it's like the, the stock market went up 30%. And me, not so much. But <laughs> I'm a lousy investor. But anyhow, I thought this is at least we're not being forced into Wall Street, right? The White House has come up with a plan so that average working people can set money aside and it doesn't get forced into Wall Street. They finally did something that wasn't for the banksters. It was just for the working people. And then I read in today's Wall Street Journal, this article by Damian Paletta, nine things you need to know about Obama's MyRA accounts. And the ninth one is the gotcha. Once someone account, well, someone's account grows beyond $15,000, the MyRA program must be rolled over into a private sector Roth IRA. Give me a friggin' break. You're listening to the Tom Hartman Program. Call 866-987-THOM. I mean, it, we've got to get money out of politics. You know, go to move to and, and it, let all your friends know. 